Welcome to Good Bites Takeout. I'm Alex, and this is the show where I make the most of the fact that I can't go out to eat, so instead, I take it to go. Today, I'm in the Montreal borough of Westmount, and I'm here for pizza. Gentile Pizza Parlor serves up 16-inch pies created by superstar pizza chef Dan Crystal. Inspired by pizza spots in New York and Philadelphia, and channeling strong 80s vibes, Gentile is checking off all the right boxes for me. Basically, three concepts that go into one, a pizza dive uh, in the day, uh, New York, New Jersey parlor vibe, and then a night artisanal 12 inch individual, slice counter, uh, cocktail bar, arcade of the month, uh, so many aspects that go into one. With uh, It all goes down to trying to be the best pizza with uh, artisanal, best products, and an amazing vibe. The cheese slice is um, it's very light, it's very fluffy, it's very airy. It's completely unlike any other dough you're gonna have in Montreal. It's a blend of different cheeses that we selected, and we can taste the difference, and we hope you can too. And the loaded is our version of an all-dressed. It's got the best capicolo in the city. It's got uh, marinated artichoke hearts, some really good mushrooms, and really high quality Tajasca olives that I put underneath the sauce, and the pepperoni square. We went out of our way to get a locally made dry cured pepperoni, um, and you can taste the difference right away. All right, I'm gonna kick things off with your cheese pizza. It's the pizza that I get at every new spot that I go to, mainly because I love cheese pizza, but also you can tell a lot about their basic option. And this is beautiful, look at that droop. Look at the way the crust is just crispy and crunchy all the way through, but at the same time, it's not very thick. I hate thick crust. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The dough is amazing, but the cheese, some of the best cheese I've ever had on a pizza. And I also love the fact that I can just fold it up like this, eat it like a mini calzone. It's not too heavy either. That's a good slice. Next up is their loaded pie. This is their take on an all dress. And I gotta say, I'm a big fan of the spread of ingredients here rather than the traditional ones. No green peppers. I can respect that. Let's give it a taste. Right off the bat, I'm gonna tell you that if you don't like olives on your pizza, you're actually gonna enjoy this. Even though there's a good medley of them on here, they're just, they're just fresh. They're just delicious olives. At the same time, all the ingredients on this pizza are very fresh, and I gotta give one more shout out to the crust. Look how thin it is. Look how well it's holding all these ingredients up together. Mmm, they're so satisfying. And for my third and final slice today, I'm gonna get a tour through Brooklyn with their Brooklyn style pizza. I gotta tell you, the aroma of pepperoni is wafting in the air. It smells amazing. Mmm, mmm, okay. Pepperoni's falling all over the place. Very liberal with their use of pepperoni, and wow, that tastes good. This is doing a lovely job of just sitting on top. The cheese is the cheese, the pepperoni is doing its own thing, and it's mixing together in your mouth. Just beautifully, this is good. Oh, and I have to mention that they have insane mozzarella sticks. Look at this. And that is it for this episode of Good Bites Takeout. Thank you for making it to the very end. And listen, if you want to check out what Gentile Pizza Parlor has to offer, you can find them on DoorDash, Uber Eats, and on Check Please. And if you're still hungry, don't worry. I'm going to be back next week with a brand new spot for some takeout. See you then.